first thing we ought to do. Um, we, ought to, we ought to hook into the whole process of having that conversation with God using the Holy Spirit. All right? Because God, the Holy Spirit is direct, the direct line, excuse me, the direct line to God. The direct line. We have a bunch of languages. I mean, right now, I think they said that there's somewhere in the neighborhood of 2,000 languages in the world. All right? So at any given moment, you can be misspeaking something, all right? Or mis not understanding something, all right? But the Holy Spirit is your, your specific, you, first person singular, your specific line to God. Now, he's made every person on the face of this earth, and every person, the person on the face of this earth has the Holy Spirit available to that person. Every person is the extent to which they call on the Holy Spirit. So what's the thing that you need to do is to talk to the Holy Spirit. Well, how do you talk to the Holy Spirit? Well, you know, you can talk like this and probably get, you know, he can get confused and you can get confused trying to find the right word to talk to him. Or you can really speak in his language or in the language. And what's that language? That language is something that's very specific and very clear to God from you. It's your language to him. All right? And it may sound different. It probably will sound different. You know? It probably it will be what is necessary for you to speak with God and for him to speak with you. People say, I don't want to sound like that. They sound crazy. All right? Them people sound they this mouth they huh, and they get to holler and the camera and slobbering at the mouth and the camera. They, whether or not they do that or not is irrelevant. The question is, are you talking with them? Are you right. doing something? So that's another Bible lesson. The Holy Spirit is available to us to allow us to have a direct conversation with God who gives us then umbra, uh, umbra. He gives us He gives us He gives us the words that we need to have. See that that's what that's what happens when you get into English language, you don't know what a word is supposed to be. Yeah. All right? <laughs> All right. Um the, the, he gives us that direct line. So again, one of the things that we need to do and the things that we don't we misunderstand about the about scripture. About about the about the words about Bible verses and getting things, getting scriptures, we get confused that well with the Holy Spirit you got to sound like really strange you got to be jumping around you got you got to spin no 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 you can be in your car, in your car like I do a lot, me in my car and I say, Lord, I really need to think this clearly about what I'm getting ready to say or what I'm getting ready to do, and He says then stop using English language, and He said just talk. And I start talking. Now, I'm not going to do it right now for you, but I could. All right? And he says, talk. And I talk. And I'm driving along. And I honestly, sometimes I'm driving along, and I kind of glance over and look at somebody you know, next to me, and the person looking at me like, what is wrong with you? <laughs> what is going on? You know, because I'm not, hey, why I can't do that. Now, my mouth is moving, right? <laughs> And if they happen, you know, sometimes in the summertime when the windows are down, you know, mm -hmm. they're listening, they're looking at you like, and I'm saying, that, yeah, it's cool. You know, and you can stop, too, whenever you need to. You can stop. You, just, you can just come to a halt and say, no, I'm just talking to somebody, you know, really important. Oh, drive. Okay, you drive. <laughs> I drive. You know, and then I go back and talk to them again. Right? Yes. I mean, it, it's, it's what we need to do. Again, don't misinterpret the scripture to say that you need to be with somebody, be at a certain place, act a certain way. Just do it. Just talk to it. Because the clarity of our, of our everyday life is directly dependent, directly related to the extent to which we have clarity from God and to, as to what we need to do. Mm -hmm. So God's clarity, which is perfect, by the way, breaks our life much better, makes our life much, much, much better. All right.